listen, friend. Heard that the authorities looking for you. You best think about leaving town soon. I hate to see you go, but I'd hate it worse if they picked you up. Did you hear me? Hey, keep up the good work. The more bandit cars you destroy, the more you learn. Excellent work. You're a major asset to the Resistance. I'll get this drive to Lassard as soon as we get back to our base. Hopefully he'll be able to uncover what's on it. But as of now, time is against us. And it's becoming more dangerous for you here. But... go on. Tell him. We've still got some unfinished business. Before I was captured, I was en route to the old Authority research facility in Dead City. I was looking for some type of proof of what the Authority was doing with the mutants. Yes. We've got reports that the Authority has reprogrammed nanotrites and are using them to control mutants, changing them into something far worse than they are now. My guess is, they figured out a way to use them as weapons. But we don't know how far they got before they were overrun and had to abandon the city. We need that data. There may be a way to reverse the process, but only if we understand the mutant experiments better. And if for nothing else, we can use the information to expose the real nature of the Authority. So, my friend, before we leave, You've got to help us find that data. We suspect you can find a copy of the data on the old servers. But to reach them, you'll have to get to the top floors of the research building and locate the network room. The main server will be there, somewhere. Find that data, and you'll have done another great service to the Resistance. Think you can do it, friend? Remember, the Authority knows you're around, and they'll be looking for you. Take anything from that crate you think you'll need. Now move fast, and good luck. <laughs> Care to browse my selection? I have some of the finest goods. You keep causing the authority pain and we'll all have trouble here.
my selection? Care to trade? Pleasure doing business with you. I need the road safer. You have made one great find. It shows us all about the Authority's deadly plans. Trust me, this is a major blow to them, and a great day for our cause. Elizabeth had a good feeling about you. I may have to agree with her. But now it's time to say your goodbyes. Elizabeth has gone on ahead to make preparations for our arrival. Don't worry about the stuff in your garage. It'll be waiting for you. But we need to leave soon ourselves. The price on your head will only increase if you stay here. This place just isn't safe for you. We've deployed a communications scrambler, which should help mask our exit. So if you're with us, then come back here when you wrap up any loose ends, and we'll leave together. So, you ready to leave? Excellent. Let's go. you decided to join us. We're probably just days away from the authority finding you. But you've heard the expression, out of the frying pan, well, welcome to the fire. Fighting the authority is all I know. I've been doing it ever since my Ark emerged. I saw what they were doing. Nothing like this was supposed to happen after the asteroid hit. For once, our government had a good plan and good people in place to make it happen. But General Cross changed the timing of only a few arcs. Arcs filled with his people. And that changed the course of humankind. Now, it's our job to make sure it isn't forever. There's Crescent City, or what's left of it. Our base sits right below it. All right, come this way. Our base is just through that door. Sard, Marshal here. Security code 1228. Roger, Captain. Welcome back. I see you have our guest. This way. Welcome to our little home. It's a bit of a mess, but we like it. All right, people. A little introduction of our new guest. You know he's an ARC survivor. He's also pretty tough. Gets the job done. I know he'll fit in well. In short, trust him. You see that arc, all in pieces over there? It was the one I was buried in. But now Lassard uses it as the brains of our operation. Nice to meet you. Yes, sir. Captain Marshall was buried in that thing. But I've re-rigged the systems, and now I can track most authority movements and communicate with our people around the wasteland. Precisely. And Elizabeth, you know. Good to see you again. And still in one piece. Actually, it's Dr. Cadence. And she's been getting closer to solving the riddle of the Authority's work with the mutants. Every little step brings me closer to the truth. And Jack Borkman, over there, he handles ordnance. If it 
shoots or explodes, we can help you with it. That's right, friend. It's like my birthday every day around here. Especially when my work helps take out some of the authority bastards. And lastly, above us, keeping the lid tightly closed on our base of operations, is Saul. He runs the garage in town, and he's already got your stuff in a bay. You'll meet him when you go up. Okay, a couple things you need to know. Subway town above us? Well, it isn't Wellspring. They walk a fine line, keeping the authority at bay and also dealing with us. You'll have to be careful there. And the town's boss, Redstone. Be extra careful around him. He'd sell you out to the authority in a heartbeat unless you're of use to him. 